But the reason Hahui and Yangdong villages are registered as world heritages is that they are not places frozen in history, but dynamic communities with traditional characters. Hahui Village started to enjoy global fame after some famous foreign figures paid a visit. Queen Elizabeth II visited in 1999. Followed by former U.S. President George Bush in 2005. Both lauded the village's heritage. The elders say that the guardian gods have safeguarded their villages over the long years. Hawe villagers believe that this 600-year-old Zelkova tree in the middle of the village embodies their guardian god. Even the tourists who visit make a wish before the tree. And as two decides to make a wish. What did he wish for near the end of his journey? This one here, it's mine. I wrote it. I hope Turkey and Korea's uh, relationship will be much better. This is my hope. Thank you. two traditional villages visited by a young man from Turkey. There, he witnessed living and breathing heritage and culture found nowhere else. I met people, I saw places, I felt really great history in this area and I can see all of them was still alive here. That's why it was perfect. And all people are trying to uh, make survive their tradition in this area. That was really uh, respectful for me too. The places were not of relics, but of people. That is why new traditions are being made there, even at this moment. Actually, I've been in Korea 10 years and it was my first time to visit these kind of traditional places. I, I think there are a lot of different routes and different places too in Korea. On this trip I was just going to experience nature but actually I saw culture, history, people and customs. Yeah, I hope we will have another opportunity to, to visit that places and show to people and they teach the people Korea has these kind of places too. It would be fun. Yeah. Yeah, look forward to it. Yeah. Okay. Nice to meet you. Yeah. A tranquil moment and beautiful sceneries on the road. A glimpse into dynamic heritage and living history. And stories of people's lives. The mosaic of these diverse colors and images is the past, present, and future of North Gyeongsang Province.